Hello everyone, let me walk you through the demo of DHL Parcel Shipping Integration in Odoo by Browseinfo. This application connects Odoo with DHL shipping and tracking services, streamlining your entire fulfillment process. Ideal for e-commerce businesses, it automates label generation, shipment tracking, and courier management directly within Odoo. This integration reduces manual handling, boosts efficiency, and improves the overall customer experience by ensuring fast and reliable deliveries through one of the world's top logistic providers. So first of all, we will go into the inventory module. Here, under configuration, we will find a menu for delivery methods. Open that and here you can see the delivery method DHL Parcel DE. Under that, you need to enter the DHL Parcel DE configuration. In that, you need to add the credentials such as client ID and client secret. After entering the client ID and client secret, you need to click on generate token. After clicking on that, you will get a notification that token generated successfully. After this, you need to refresh your page for your token. So here you can see that your access token and token expiry is updated in here. Under that, you will find the field for DHL shipping products. You need to select your product accordingly. So I have selected DHL packet in here and according to this shipping product in availability tab, my country will be updated. So here you can see my country is updated to Germany. Under that, you need to add a table type, label type. So here I have selected this label type. Now, after this, we will go into the configuration uh, of the inventory. So again, we will go into the inventory module and in here we are going into the configuration and we will go into the DHL rate configurators. So here you can create your own configuration. Here I have created configuration name as DHL, weight, is, uh, fr weight from is 0 and weight 2 is 5 kg and rate is 100. So that means any product weighting between 0 to 5 will be having shipping rate as 100. So I'm going to uh, create a quotation. So click on new and add a customer. I will be adding Daco Addict as my customer. And under that, you need to see that the, uh, the country for the customer is Germany. Now under that, we are going to add our product. So I will be adding a chair a cabinet with doors. So here you can see the product is cabinet with doors. Now I'm going to click on add shipping button. And here I need to select a shipping method, which I will be selecting DHL parcel. And under that you can see the weight is 0 0.01 kg. So now if I click on get rate, you can see the cost field is updated to 100. After this, we will be uh, click on, uh, clicking on add. And here you can see that your delivery method is applied in here. Now we are going to confirm this sale order and you can see a delivery is created. So open that delivery and in here you can see the delivery number. Under that you can see the product. Now in the additional info you can see the carrier is DHL parcel DE. So for this we are going to validate this receipt so here you can see that your an additional info tracking references updated and you can also see that in the chatter the shipment sent to the carrier dhl parcel for shipping will with this this tracking number and this this cost under that you can see the label attached for your shipping you can just open the pdf and you can see the label for your shipping with all the details regarding your product and everything not only here but you can also see that there is one tracking uh, smart button if you click on that you will be redirected to the tracking page now in the tracking reference field only you will find the cancel button as soon as you click on that it will ask for your confirmation whether you want to cancel it or not so we are just going to click on ok and you can see that the cancellation is done you can see the tracking reference field is updated and also in the chatter you can see shipment this 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 is cancelled 
Now, after this, we are hopping into our e-commerce. So we are going into the website module. Here, we will go into the shop and we are going to add products into our cart. So I will be adding cabinet with door into my cart. Click on add to cart. And here you can see, click on view cart. After this, you can see the product. We are going to click on checkout. Click on checkout. Here in the delivery method, you can see there is DHL parcel delivery method along with standard delivery. So we are going to select on DHL and you can see that it is in 100 euros. So now we are going to click on confirm after this and you need to add your payment details. So you need to add your card number and everything in here. And after that, just click on pay now. After clicking on pay now, you can see your payment has been successfully processed. Now under configuration, we will go into the payment transaction and in here you can see the reference payment amount and every little detail regarding your transaction is in here and also that it is in confirmed state indicating it is done. And you can also can see the sale order in here for your transaction. You can see all the details in here. If you have any queries about this video, you can ask them in the comment box and we will solve your queries. If you feel this video is useful to you, please like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more Odoo related videos. Thanks for watching.